in this video I'll show you how to fix on your PS4 if you get this error, which is the CE3487-8-0. This can be pretty frustrating if it's happening while you're playing games, so why not try my trick? It only takes about 3 minutes. Alright, so let's start with the first step, which is to go into your game library, find the game that it's giving you this error, and then on your controller press the options button. Then all you have to do is to delete the game. Step number two is to eject the game, so the disc from your PS4. Take it out. And the next step is to simply turn off your PS4 completely and then you want to turn it back in safe mode. To do so you need to locate the power button on your PS4 and then you need to keep it pressed around 6 seconds until you hear the second beep. So there will be a first beep, keep it pressed and then after 6 seconds you'll hear another one and then you can release. You won't be able to use the wireless feature of your controller so you need to connect it physically with a cable to your PS4. Once you connect it both, you'll be able to select the option number 5 using the D-pad on your controller. This option is called Rebuild Database. Select it. Now it will take a few minutes, your PS4 will do its thing, let it do, don't touch anything while it's uh, actually processing. And then after it's done, you'll need to reinstall the game. And if there is any game updates or software updates for your PS4, you'll also need to install them. Hopefully after doing everything, you won't see this error ever again. If you have other tricks that help solve this problem, please share them down below in the comments, since it's gonna help somebody else for sure. Thanks for watching and don't forget to leave a like and maybe even subscribe.